Did not mean to do that. Oh well. Let me see. Clinic, Upper City, Cantina, Emporium. Let's go to the Cantina. I think. I think there's something. Oh, more Karth time. Yes, what's on your mind? Uh, you do? Well, fair enough. What do you want to discuss? We didn't finish our talk, dog. <laughs> I know you wouldn't understand where I was coming from. Let me try and explain. You got the skills of an elite commando, and you saved my butt more than once. Between that and your facility with languages, I'm lucky you're here. But that doesn't mean that I'm gonna stop watching you being wary. I'm just not built that way. Period. What an excuse, Maybe dog. so, but I've been betrayed before by people up Well, it just won't happen again, that's all. Uh, sick of your crap, man. Yeah, well, you wouldn't be the first. Look, I don't expect you to be my friend. This is just the way I am. No need to take it personally. Um... Can you even trust yourself? Well, you can stop wondering. I'm not. Uh, we don't need some non-trusting dude, yo. And I don't need all these questions. What I do need is to try and save the galaxy. That's even possible. Why is don't. whether or not I trust you or anyone so damned important to you? Why, why do you even care? We don't have time for this, so can we please just drop it for now? Can we pick it up later if you really must? I'm, I want to get underway. I like to find uh, this last guy, but I don't remember where he was. I know we ran into him, but I don't remember where it was. Hello there. I haven't seen you in my shop before. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Kebla Yurt. Welcome to the Equipment Emporium. You looking to buy some supplies? My shop's the largest one in all... Mostly. What do you mean by the Sith? Thank, thank you. I thought we'd been here before, uh, but I guess not. Just so... Uh, let's see. What you got? What you got? Fibro blade, quarterstaff, wookie war blade. Scrappy. Probably looks cool. Probably looks pretty cool. Sith Warblade, slightly better. The Ichani Ritual Brand. Look, I know this one looks pretty cool, but it's really crappy. Wookie Warblade is cheap as crap. I'll take, I'll take it! I didn't know it was that freaking cheap, man. Uh, let's see, let's see, what else? Ooh. Collisions, breathe mask, immunity to poison, plus one to dex, and all saves. And there's no way to ever accumulate that amount of credits on this planet. Bothian machinist gloves? I might pick those up. It's pretty cheap. Pretty cheap for a plus four to demolition. Uh, plus one to stealth, fortitude. Stealth generator. What is this? What it? Uh. I'll take it. Why not? It's cheap. Uh. Nah. We don't need. We don't need plus four to demolitions. Clothing. Unfortunately, we can't sell that because it's worthless to everyone. Don't need that. That's meaty. I like how it's a light battle suit, but it's medium armor. Sell two of those. Silky Warblade. Blaster, don't need that. The ion, we'll hold on to one. Disruptor, what do disruptors do? Aren't they supposed to, like, eat through? Oh, they ignore shields, that's why. That's what makes them special. Standard issue blaster rifles. We don't want them because they're crappy, stupid, worthless. Shield, reflexes, fortitude, Emery. I think I have Im I think I have implant level one. I think. I hope somebody's got it. I'm pretty sure someone's got implant level one. Right? Oh, sweet, I've got implants level one. Booyah! 
I are smart. I am too smart. I am too smart. S O M E T R. I mean, whatever, smart, yeah. Cantina is where I be heading. And it's the complete wrong direction. What? Karth, my man. I knew you were good for something. Ha <laughs> ha. Saves me some time holding down the forward key. The cantina is locked, apparently. Never mind. Yeah? Sure. Ready. What's going on, Sith dude? Don't bother me. I'm here on official Sith business. Alright. What? Thanks for what? nothing, Sith dude. Or I guess thanks for the talk, Sith dude. We got business in the cantina. You dig? What if I can have, like, Karth or Mission, like, fight in the arena for me? Probably not. Oh, I totally remember where that last guy is. It's not here. Uh, but... I can do some fighting against, uh, I think it was Ice we were still, we were fighting. And she's gonna, like, kick my face in royally. <laughs> I think I... Ladies quits. and gentlemen, over in this corner, yes, yes. a woman with steel on her bones and ice water in her veins. Check your She's face. cold and quick as death. We all know this. My equips have gotten a little bit better, so I think I can maybe take her. Aha! Oh. Ow. Aha! It's over! The fight is over! The mysterious stranger has won! Ice is knocked out cold! Looks like we have a rising star in the mysterious stranger, folks! But how high can this star soar? You'll just have to watch and see! mysterious stranger, you're so cool! Shot my face! I am the greatest. Ten percent of three hundred. Uh, you do the map and find out how much he really made. I'm gonna save. Yes. Who am I fighting? Moral. Ladies and gentlemen, draw your eyes to the center ring. We have a very special presentation in store for you. He's a legend in the sport. A 20-year veteran who still knows how to show the young kids a trick or two. Let's have a big hand for... Marl! But there's always some young gun coming up to knock the veterans off. And we've got one of the best right here. I give you... The Mysterious Stranger! Yeah, Mysterious Stranger, you're so cool! Alright, let's get murdered. <laughs> Wow. I got a lot of damage. Whoa, he did not even attack me and I just died. Stranger is mur Ooh, you killed my favorite man. You killed my legend. I hate you, you suck. God dang it. Uh, we'll come back later. What's up, dude? Pretty impressive, stranger. Ice is no pushover. People are starting to take notice of you. They say you're the best thing to come along since Twitch stepped into the ring. If you're going to keep climbing the ranks, then I guess I'm next on your hit list, kid. I'm looking forward to it. Do you not remember? Like, Goodbye, stranger. Have you just purged the last, like, minute from your mind where you just, like, stomped me? Because I, I haven't. I'm freaking still walking that crap off, man. That hurt. What's up, Starkiller? Wait, that was... that. His name was Starkiller, wasn't it? 
Index Star Killer. No relation to uh, Galen Merrick, I imagine. For those of for those of you who are less aware, Galen Merrick is the guy from Sw or not Swotor Unleashed, Star Wars: The Force Unleashed. He is, although he is named Star Killer. Yes, we're going to. We just need to go to the upper city. Yeah, I can't return. Or I can't transit back to the under siege, under city, not the under siege. That's something else, something entirely different. So now we get like two minutes worth of walking and thirty seconds worth of waiting. And waiting. We can do this. Oosh. 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 Hey, look at me, I'm so cool, I'm so cool. Doo, 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 doo. The Trucif died out centuries ago. Yeah, Trucif, they're those red dudes with the tentacle faces. You can play as them in Svotor. Uh, the apartments. Hey, Karth, you're a pilot for the Republic, right? You've been all over the galaxy, I bet, right? So tell me, how would you rate Taurus compared to other worlds you've seen? To be honest, Mission, Terrace would rate pretty low. The prejudice, the rich spoiling themselves while the poor are crushed beneath them, it, it's not a pretty picture. Yeah, but that's only since the Sith occupation. Before that, well, I guess it wasn't all that different, really. Hmm, maybe Taurus ain't as great as I thought, you know? Trust me, Mission, there are a lot of worlds better than Terrace. There, there are worse, too, but Terrace is no place for a kid to live on her own. Even a kid who's got a Wookiee to look out for. Her. Hey, I ain't no kid. I look out for Zalbar as much as he looks out for me. Big Z's my friend, not my babysitter. Jeez, I come ask you a question, you give me a lecture. Don't you snap at me, Missy. You want a lecture? How's this? Only bratty little children fly off the handle because of a simple comment. Oh, my turn? He's right, but I don't care. Uh... Shut your faces. I don't have to listen to you, Karth. You ain't my father, though you're sure old enough to be. So keep your lectures inside your withered old head, because I don't need them. And I sure as hell don't need this. Look, let's just drop it and get back to what we were doing. Isn't it great when no matter what, opt what dialogue options I have, they just straight up ignore me? As if my... Can my contribution, my small, limited contribution to this conversation is completely pointless and meaningless. Isn't it great? Did that say Sif party? Oh, it totally did. I totally remember. Let's see if I can click on some dude in the distance. Oh, good. Hey there. What can I do for you? I don't know. You're staring at me. Really? You want to know about me? Nobody's ever really been interested in me before. What do you want to know? Um... Big Z's my family, you know? My parents, well, I guess they're dead. It was just me on my own until the day I saw Zalbar in the lower city. I could tell right away he was in trouble. This was before the gang wars were out of hand. But even then, the Volkers were scum. A few of them were hassling Big Z, trying to pick a fight, but he wasn't looking for trouble. Yeah, who'd pick a fight with a Wookiee? That's hey, dumb. nobody said the Volkers were smart, but there were three of them. So, maybe they figured they could handle him. I don't know. Anyway, I don't like the Volkers at the best of times. And when I saw them picking on this poor Wookiee, all alone on a strange planet, overwhelmed by the big city, I just lost it. I screamed out, Leave him alone, you core slimes! And charged right at them. Well, one of them saw me coming and slapped me so hard he just about knocked me cold. Knocked out cold? With <laughs> yeah, he could have. He could have fried you with a blaster. Hey, dog. I don't need a lecture from you. You ain't my mother. I knew what I was doing. Sure. Those Volkers didn't scare me. They're nothing but cowards. I knew how to deal with them. Of course, I never got the chance. I guess Zalbar didn't like seeing me get smacked around. He let out this howl and yanked that Volker a meter up off the ground and held him there by his throat. Meter off the ground. Pretty high. Are you kidding? Big Z ain't like that. He's just a big old softy inside. 
Of course, the Volkers didn't know that. The other two screamed and ran off. Can't say I blame them. The first time you see an angry Wookiee up close, it isn't a pretty sight. I thought Zalbar was gonna rip that punk's arms off and beat him to death with his own fists. The Volker was so scared, he fainted. Or maybe it was Big Z's breath just knocked him out. I keep telling Zalbar to brush those choppers of his, but he never listens. Just stay upwind when he's speaking and you'll be fine. Anyway, I knew those Volkers would be back with friends, so I grabbed Zalbar and we took off. Ever since then, we've been a team. We look out for each other, you know? Okay. Why is he here? He was fleeing some kind of trouble back on Kashyyyk. That's all I know, really. Big Z doesn't like to talk about it. In case you didn't notice, he's the strong, silent type. Doesn't much matter to me, though. I accept him for what he is, not what he was. Me and Zalbar like to live in the present. Uh... Hey, what's that supposed to mean? You think I can't take care of myself? I've got that. street smarts. I know how to get by on my own. In fact, I look out for Zalbar more than he looks out for me, you know? Big Z is a little bit too gullible to make it alone on the mean streets of the lower city. Okay, and we'll just... Yeah, I suppose end. you're right. Like I used to tell my brother, fast talk and slick words don't get the job done. Sure. My brother's a touchy subject, you know? It just so happens, I don't really feel like talking about him right now. Nothing personal. Let's just get back to the business at hand, okay? Fair enough. Ah, Swotor, you'll never cease to stop teaching me. What is this planet coming to, huh? Yeah. Shlami's just walking around the upper city. Shouldn't you go into the lower city as you belong, Shlami? Well, this is rich. Yeah, like he said, these streets are for upper city citizens. <laughs> you better get out of the way if you know what's good for you. Yo, dog. I could have chosen your face for my character cre during character creation. I almost did. Um, we'll just go with the fight, because we're not gonna pass the other two. Hey, this schlemmy's got a mouth. Oh, great. We're fighting the drunks, are we? And do they legs. stink? You talk big, schlemmy. Maybe you should show us a little more respect. Time to teach you a lesson, schlemmy. Maybe you'll think twice about coming up into our turf. Uh... Keep telling yourself that. Yeah! Sif guy! Go, Sif go! Go, Sif guy! Go, Sif guy! Go! Thanks, Mr. Sif guy! You Sif guys are all right. I mean, those drunks, they didn't even, like, attack. This Sif guy, he just, like, he hurried, he just started Out of our way, guy. citizen. We're on official Sith business. Just stand aside if you know what's good for you. You got it, Mr. Sith Man. You gunned those fools down so quick. I didn't even get a chance to cut them. And I don't know. There's the Lord City. Listen to me, people. That is it. Shut your face. What's up, Sith Man? This elevator is off limit. It's obvious from the way you're dressed that you're what? not one of the Sith patrols. So when... Uh. Well, why didn't you say so? Just be careful. You didn't give me a chance. You just said, yo, dog, you can't go down there. Freaking just let me say, I got papers, yo. Let me through. I'll freaking say so. And I am looking for apartments. This way. I don't know why you can do this, but I like doing it because it's cool. Man, it's not really cool when you're holding like a vibro sword, but it's still kind of cool. It's cooler when you get when you're like dual wielding lightsaber and you do it. It's like zoom, zoom. just wait, just you wait, dear viewer person. Just you wait. When I get my hands on some lightsabers, we gonna be the coolest guy ever. We'll be like. Will be like Grievous before he goes all forearms, which I guess he only does that once in the movie. But if you watch like one of the animated things or like a comic, he goes like he goes forearms a lot more often in those. But he dual wields like he actually does stuff in the comic and the cartoon. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 
Oh. Dies. Spoiler alert for a, like, I don't know. A five year old movie? I mean, who hasn't seen that freaking movie by this point? If you haven't, I feel freaking. If you haven't, I don't know why you're watching it. Oh. Oh. I mean, I guess if you're, like, somehow, like, trying to experience Star Wars in some kind of, like, order, we've done this already, I remember it. Was, um. It was, like, the pet with the uncle on Tatooine. And I think this might have been the incorrect location. This was definitely the incorrect location. God dang it. Oh, I freaking... I think I know where to go. 